Okay, so boom, GD potential. <laughs> Gone wrong, so I'm sitting in the cell. I'm cool with my cell. I went down there to the child hall, right? So I done got up, went to the spot, pulled out that toy, called my girl on FaceTime. I'm looking at her, she looking at me, we looking at each other, right? She don't even know I really done call her because I done got to know her a little bit. And she done told me, you know what I'm saying? She like it in the morning. So I'm finna try to get her in the nude. And as I'm sitting here talking, I'm finna get ready to get to it. All of a sudden, dramatic effect me, please. I heard, ta ta ta. I look at the door, the door looking at me, me and the door looking at each other. I'm already knowing what's gonna be said. I said, man, what's going on? Hey, Joe T, I need to holler at you real quick, bro. I said, hold on, hold on real quick. I'm on something real quick. I ain't saying I'm on the phone. I ain't saying I'm working out. I ain't saying I'm praying. I ain't saying I'm studying. I ain't saying I'm using the bathroom. I ain't saying I'm getting myself together. I'm on something right now. Guess what my man holler out? Man, GB the reason, bro. My gal heard that on the phone. Guess what she say? Because I'm doing her like this. Get what she say? I can't stand the guys. I said, well, she calling the guy. I said, I can't stand them neither. I said, I'm gonna call you right back. She said, hurry up, I can, before I go to work. I said, hold on, I'm gonna call you right back. You ain't finna call me. I get up. I get up. I'm looking at him, he looking at me, we looking at each other. He said, man, bro, just got into it with a vice lord down there. They just took your cellar down there. To, they just took your cellar to the hole. I said, man, for what? He said, man, he done went in the, he done went in the vice lord mouth down there. I'm already knowing what time it is. Now I got to come out, see what's going on, investigate the situation. Now I'm trying to tell you, I got to go over here and holler at the vice lord to make sure, you know what I'm saying, whatever just happened, that's the end. So I come on out of the cell, right? Poo, close the door. But in the back of my mind, that's what I'm thinking, though. <laughs> my cellar went to the hole? Now, now, I ain't, now I messed up, you know what I'm saying? My cellar went to the hole, not because he the bitch, you know what I'm saying? Me and my cellar, cool, you know what I'm saying? We eat together, he got his own food. He ain't one of them, you know what I'm saying? You got to take care of. He always asking for something. Hey, hey, silly man. I ain't even gonna lie, man. That ain't a child. They ain't even had him, man. Let me get a suit, man. Let me get a suit to store that. I'll go and take care of your business. He, he wasn't one of them. And he gonna get up. He gonna live off the land off. Was, I had a decent little set. He clean. You know what I'm saying? He don't stink none of that. You know what I'm saying? I only had a couple of times where I done ran into somebody that was a, a horrible set. This situation was turning into one. I ain't even know. So I come out of the cell and as I'm walking, you know what I'm saying, he giving me the intel, he informing me on what went down. So I'm like, wow, what, what done happened down there, G? Because I'm not trying to go somewhere. And then we walk over here and then the vice lord, they feel it some type of way. Cause guess what, G Bot? You could have left me in the cell. Y'all could have went on and went to happen that. Don't come get me. So, so, so I end up getting closed out and getting maxed out. Had I known there would have been a fight down there, had to come back at what? I wouldn't even out the door. I'd act like I was asleep. My cell had gone, my cell had gone to the hole. So y'all don't know if I'm in here sleep. Y'all don't know what I'm doing. All I would have said, man, bro, I ain't even what it, that ain't what done happened. Man, bro, them done crashed out up here the whole time. After they walked off the door, that's what I would have did. Cause I got that, I got that, I can see out, but they can't see in. Man, that's crazy. Baby, man, the guys in here, they, 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 they going in. No, I'm not finna go out there and help them. No, that, that, no, something personal done turned into GD business. That ain't got nothing to do with me. I'm not no fool. I, I mess with them, but I'm not no dumb. Dang! Let me call you right back. They probably finna lock us down. I'm gonna call you right back. I need to put the phone up. I'm not finna go for that. So he tell me that the brother done went in dude's mouth because he asked dude, when was he gonna pay him? And let me tell you something, penitentiary. Don't, 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 don't raise your voice in 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 front of everybody. Don't, don't, don't try to buck nobody, especially somebody who gonna go in your mouth. So he said, brother went down there and asked the vice lord when he was gonna pay him. Uh, he he pulled he pulled a minute. What's that? Minute to society. Man, I'm gonna pay you when I'm gonna pay you. He walking with the guys. The vice lord walking with his people. What made him think he wasn't going? The penitentiary rules is in effect. Who you talking to? He say, as soon as he say that, he say, man, who you talking to? He go straight in his mouth. Ain't nothing else to discuss after that. And get what? And the guy, we ain't doing, listen, that he ain't doing no hands laid debt pay. Because this ain't got nothing to do with the debt. This got something to do with the disrespect. So he still going to owe bro some money. So he tell me, bring on whoop dude out there. It's a one-on-one. -on -one. So the, the folks don't get in, the vice lords don't get in. But still, I'm finna go over and holler at them. You know what I'm saying? Make sure anything, anything. I'm going to see who is at the time. So we go over to the cell, one of the vice lords, I know, you know what I'm saying, he got a little rank, I don't know what he is, but he can holler at whoever he need to holler at, you know what I'm saying? Because now we, we got to do the prison politics, you know what I'm saying? I, pop, 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 pop. 
I got one of the guys with me, you know what I'm saying? He ain't and since I don't know where the PC is at the time. He man, what's going on? I said, man, it's Joe T, I need to holler at you real quick. He was like, oh, come on in, Joe. But he ain't calling me Joe. That's what they call Vice Lords. So I ain't even tripping. They, I ain't even looking at it as a form of disrespect. They just so used to saying that. So I hit, he, he said, come on in. I, Fah! Man, bless his head. He said, man, what's going on? I said, man, I'm pretty sure you already know about the situation. You know what I'm saying? I was just trying to come over and make sure, you know what I'm saying? That's a dead issue. You know what I'm saying? It was a one-on-one, -on -one, whatever. He's like, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. He said, well, I ain't even, he said, I ain't even gonna lie. He said, you know what I'm saying? People that want me to come holler at y'all, man, and see y'all. Uh, do y'all know why, you know what I'm saying? Brother them got into it. Brother and I already told him what they got into it for. He owed brother some money. So right now, I'm finna utilize the 33 strategies of war. Divide and conquer. Because at the end of the day, get what? He's a vice lord. I'm a G. I don't agree with that now, but let me tell you something. If you ain't never been to the penitentiary, I advise you to never go to the penitentiary. Because I'm going to tell you something. The way your mind and, and the survival tactics you have to have in there, you got to go to a whole nother level of finesse man and manipulation. And at this point right here, the brother don't went to the hole. Yeah, true enough, one of yours don't went to the hole. But I'm going to make sure when yours get out of the hole, he probably going back to the hole for a long time. So when brother told me, you know what I'm saying, he owed brother some money. The brother that he talking about, he don't sell nothing but class A's. And if you don't know what a class A is, and let me know you ain't never been to the penitentiary. And if you ain't never been to the penitentiary, I advise you to never go to the penitentiary. But a class A in the penitentiary, that's hard drugs. It ain't tobacco, it ain't weed. That's methamphetamine, that's that dog food, that's that, that's that white girl, Christina Aguilera, that's that hard, that, yeah, that, them class A's. So when he asked me, man, what up? Do you know what up, brother got into it for? I said, yeah, yeah, brother was just telling me, you know what I'm saying, your brother, you know what I'm saying, he been on, bro, for a little, for a little minute. He said, what he owe, bro, for? You know what I'm saying, what he owe, some commissary or something? I said, oh, no, nah, G-Body don't say nothing, number class A is on nine nines out of ten, you know what I'm saying, that, that what it was. You know, he ain't selling, he ain't selling oil or nothing around here, you know what I'm saying, he ain't smelling, he ain't selling cologne, he ain't selling Caps of tobacco, I said, oh yeah, he said in class A right here. He said, oh, for real, for real. The white lord stand up off the bed, right? He said, oh yeah, for real. He said, man, I'm glad you told me. He said, man, because brother them, brother them been having, you know what I'm saying? I know it ain't none of your business, but brother them been, you know what I'm saying, suspect of brother, because it's been a couple of incidents where brother been over here, you know what I'm saying? Do, 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 do. Now he done went to the hole, and, and then brother them said he heard him say he owed him some money, so you saying that to that? See, oh yeah, 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 yeah. Brother, brother, most definitely probably getting them at dog food or something, you know. Brother, most definitely, you know, ain't no telling, you know, really, it's, it's, man, I'm telling you, man, brother, bro don't say nothing but class A. You know, class A's is easy to get in the penitentiary. You know what I'm saying? That that that, that other stuff that you know it's kind of them, them class A is that they feel like it's easy to get in the best. So yeah, Brian, Brian said nothing but class A. He said, Oh yeah, I appreciate that, Joe. I said that was up, my guy. Cause <laughs> look, cause I don't know I don't know what's going on, cause it's a play on the words right now. Oh, that was up, Joe. Oh, that, <laughs> that was up, my guy. So we fade on out of the zero, right? <sighs> I'm looking at bro, brother looking at me, me and brother looking at me, look at what he said. Man, he's so mad, Joe. Y'all been saying, man, look where we at. Man, you done got down there. We done got down there, man. My son done went to the hole like he was going to buck, bro. Now I don't know who I'm finna get in the cell with. He was like, I was like, man, I'm going to holler at you later on, brother. I'm finna go in the cell real quick, man. Y'all need to let me know what I'm saying. I'm going to be in this. Y'all already know what I'm in. Oh, that was so what you finna do, though, bro? <laughs> I'm going to do my time, man. What you talking about what I'm going to do? Man, I already know what he finna say. Man, real man, I know you on. But, man, can you get me on the horn? No! Hey, who? I'm finna go lay down, bro. I'm finna go lay down. The view come on at 10, bro. It's early in the morning. On the view come, I'm trying to watch whooping them. Barbara Walters, you know what I'm saying? R.I.P., you know what I'm saying? I'm trying to go in here and watch Barbara Walters and them. You tripping, bro. But I'm finna go in here and try to calm my hair back real quick. So I get in the cell. Cool. I'm looking at her. She looking at me. We looking at each other. You know what I tell her? Man, my son done crashed out down there. You know what I'm saying? I went down there, put his hands on, on, on the people down there. See, who is the people? Vice Lord. Vice Lords, why do you all just get out of that mess? All of that stuff y'all be saying and all of that, 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 that just crazy. Y'all just doing too much in the penitentiary. She said, I was just sitting here thinking about when I got off the phone. Y'all in there selling everything that y'all selling. You you got a phone, you sitting in there, you 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 trying to come home and then they always at the door talking about GB the <laughs> I said, look, 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 I'm finna, matter of fact, what you finna go on, cause you, you're a cute divide. I, you, you see this right here? 
What is that? That's my lotion and baby. I didn't I didn't I didn't hear that. I'm, I'm in here doing time already. You know, I'm in here for breaking the law. I don't need nobody telling me, you know what I'm saying, what what I'm doing wrong. I'm I'm, I'm already in penitentiary. So 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 what's up? You gonna bust it wide open when I tell her, bring it back, bring it back, bring it back, bring you gonna you gonna take care of the business or not? I guess hold on. Toot that thing up, mommy. You know what I'm saying? I done, I done had the long stroke that boy in there. You know what I'm saying? I'm in the cell by myself, yo. I'm, so when I get through, I'm pack brush stuff up. Because soon, get what? <laughs> pack brush stuff up, put the phone, because the police going to come over. Ta, 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 ta. And I ain't trying to get them. They ain't trying to do no slick search or nothing. They already done told me, you know what I'm saying? I done packed brush stuff up. Y'all ain't even got to take it. I'm finna call. You know what I'm saying? Brother, I'm going to come over <laughs> Put that in the car, make sure y'all get that where it needs to go, you know what I'm saying? Because the guys, they gonna secure your stuff and everything. They gonna make sure the police don't play no type of games with your stuff. So while I'm sitting in the cell, you know what I'm saying, the day, the whole day go by, I'm excited, you know what? Because the nighttime time finna hit. I'm gonna be up all night on that toy. I ain't even gonna lie. Soon as they come through, listen, soon as they, they I'm, I'm locking down early. In the penitentiary, if you, listen, listen, if you ever been to the penitentiary, you already know. For some odd reason, Everybody like to wait to the last five to five and a half minutes to go to the microwave. So the microwave line gonna be long when they hung. Lockdown, lockdown, then all of a sudden, dramatic effect, me please. Everybody running to the microwave. Hey G, hey G, hey, 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 hey. They throwing stuff off the top. Hey, put that in the microwave, jump. Put me in line real quick. Hold on, family. You, you can't be throwing nothing off the top. Walk, come down, talking about put you in line. You cut your stuff down here, yo, but you physically need to be down here. I've seen it all the time. They, hey, bro, hold it right there. That's my spot right there, man. I'm there. Hold on, bro. I was already coming down the step finna get in line physically. You think you finna throw a piece of food down here to hold your, man, you crazy as hell. Hey, your team, man, bro, uh, bro, what? Man, bro, just threw you a cheese by here talking about hold this spot. Man, you tripping, bro. Man, that's crazy, Joe. He just gonna do. It. Come on, bro. We in penitentiary. You know, I ain't, I, ain't, I, I would never know. Commercial break, me, please. And if you ain't already got the book, I need you to do me a favor. Go get the book. And matter of fact, if you want to hear the rest of this story, you go listen. It, it's just five dollars. Go get your membership. I promise you, it's gonna be worth it. The really the only reason why I'm doing it because I know a lot of people gonna jump in the comments and say, "Man, Joe T, I can't. You know, I got something I'm trying to do." So it ain't, it ain't that I'm, you know what I'm saying, trying to be petty or nothing. It's just goals I'm trying to accomplish, and it's just so happen to be something that I can utilize and do it. If you ain't got the book, go get the book. It's two for 25. You want the membership? Listen, for everybody who asks where the membership link is at, it's in the description. Click the little part where the title is at. It's going to fold down. It's going to show you the description, and you can just go from there. It's going to take you straight to the subscription. It's $5. That's all I'm asking. But look, check this out. Check this out. Check this out. So, I, I was never no tough guy in the penitentiary. Never. I ain't never walked around the penitentiary like I'm on Jean-Claude Van Damme or put that knife in. I ain't never, ever been that type of guy. I was always laid back cool. I always used my mind. I always thought things out. I ain't never bucked nobody. I was never the guy... You know what I'm saying? If I want to pull the bum down, listen, something done got extremely out of hand. I just wasn't them, one of them type of guys in penitentiary. I seen them dudes in penitentiary all the time. And get what? They don't survive long in the penitentiary. You can run around there thinking you tough all you yeah, That was up. And get what? If they don't end up getting stuck on or getting maxed out, because going to max is the worst thing in a penitentiary. You can say what you want to say. Go on and go be tough for a year, thinking everybody's scared of you on the compound. And then you do something and they max you out for 18 months. And then after they max you out for 18 months, you got to come down and you go to close for another six months. So they done got two years out of your own 23 and one. Get what? This right here going to be a little throwed out. And then you're going to feel like most dudes in the streets because they play the same games they do in the street. They're going to feel like they got something to prove when they come back out. And guess what? They still got a, they got their revolving door back there in the hole, in close, and on max, just like they do when you come through the penitentiary, coming through the courthouse. They waiting for you to do something you ain't got no business doing. And then guess what? Your points going to be, they going to be ready for you. 
you going to come out here, you going to think you got something to prove, or you going to pick on somebody that you know ain't really about nothing, and you going to end up getting caught. And before you know it, guess what they going to be saying? Man, they're crazy, man. Cub, man, they did Cub wrong, man. Cub done came out here, man, and did what he did. You know what I'm saying? They done sent Cub back to Max again. And you done went back there and get what? Ain't none of your homeboy sent you a red cent back there. Yeah, go on, come on out here and take your talk. I, I was never that type of guy. And if they don't go to Max and Cloak, get what they end up doing? Huh? <laughs> Tattoos on their face? I thought we were doing time. It looked like at time doing you. What's wrong with you? I just, look, I just seen you three months ago. Hey, hey, you know what I'm telling myself? Cause me and my sister, I, I'm out, me and my sister, I was, hey, shit, me, you see what's name? Man, what's wrong with him? Man, he moved out in front of the top of the head, you seen him? Man, I was thinking the same thing, bro. Man, he done got jumped out, ain't he? I ain't even gonna lie to you, bro. I, I, I served him a match head. Oh, what? Shoot, <laughs> I don't care what he is, who is, bro, I served him a match head. He doing dog food? Man asked me to watch the door, he shoot the net, dang. I'm going to tell him he got. Man, that little bit of sentence, he ain't got nothing but a six-year sentence. He, he think he doing time too, don't he? And time killing him. And then, see, that, that's how it always happened. So I want my food. I'm going to go in the sale early. So I go in the sale, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> when you go in the lockdown, I'm waiting for him to come through, do the count. I'm going to put that C in. You, you can't see in, but I can see out as soon as he come through the count. And then at the bottom of the bunk, you know what I'm saying? Penitentiary rules in the vet. If you ever been to the penitentiary, you already know what it's saying. Well, how the bunk is set up right here on the end. If you look in the door, you can look in and you can see the person on the bottom and the top. See, I'm going to take that extra blanket. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to take that extra blanket. I'm going to fold it. I'm going to put it over the bar on the top bunk. It's going to hang down and it's going to block. When they try to see in, even though I got my violation up, it's going to block the whole bottom bunk. I'm going to turn that TV on. Cow! The light going to... When the light come on, get what? I'm going to pull that toy out. When I power him up, that light, it ain't going to show like it's an extra light in the zip. So I'm finna ball out in here. I ain't got to worry about whispering because my cell is gone. I ain't got, listen, listen, and, 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 and I hate to even admit this, but it, it's been some times in the penitentiary where if I hear, I done hear my cell is snoring, y'all can judge me all you want, but I'm going to keep it funky with you like a father. It's been a couple of times where I done been on that phone whispering and she done got to talking good. Now I got the stroke in that pig and you know what I'm saying? I'm trying to make sure you don't... Like they slow strokes. It's gonna take a long time. I done had to catch him at one. You know what I'm saying? But tonight, oh, making all kind of noises. I'm mean, here. So low, do low. What you doing? You've been to do it and do it. Stay right there. Stay right there. You know what I'm saying? I'm finna look shy, shy, shy. So I take care of my business, right? In the morning, you know what I'm saying? They hollering, child. Everybody slamming doors. You can already hear the dominoes. They. Oh, what's up, what's up, what's up? What we doing on the spade? What we doing on the spade? So I get up, a couple of hours go back. I'm looking at the back window, right? I'm seeing people coming from the hole. It's a couple of them coming out of there. About six, seven of them. So I'm looking at like, man, no way these folks finna give me a cell in less than 24 hours because that's usually how it go. You ain't, you ain't finna be in that cell by yourself for a long time. You know what I'm saying? I'm like, man, that's crazy, man. I can't even get 13 hours by myself. So I come out of the cell, right? Like, Walk my little bow legs here over by the big one. I'm trying to go see. Let me see. What? Hey, Joe T, let me holler at you real quick. Hold on, bro. I'm on something right now, bro. I'm trying to see if I'm going to get a silly, man. I'm looking at the back window. Hey, man, they coming in here too, man. I, <laughs> I go to the front door. Joe T, what's up? What we doing? We ain't doing nothing right now, bro. Hold on real quick. You can't, if you come out in the unit in the penitentiary, listen to me. If you got tobacco, Somebody gonna try to flag you down like you got crack on the town. Hey, 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 Joe T, Joe T, Joe T, man, I've been waiting for you to come out the cell. I ain't wanna come over and knock on the door because I ain't know if you was asleep. I ain't know if you was on something. Which, oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Only thing you need to say, my guy, is I ain't wanna come over and knock on the door because I ain't know if you was asleep. All the rest of that stuff, trying to figure out if I got a phone, if I if I got tobacco, just kill all the penitentiary lingo. Man, I, I didn't know if you was over there. I would go, I would just, I would, I would wait for you to come back. You know what I'm saying? I would try to smoke some. That's all you had to say. <laughs> hey, Joe T, man, what's up? Let me, let me, oh, man, hold on real quick. So I'll go to the front door. They come through the front door, right? I ain't finna stop no, no, man. I ain't, I ain't one of them guys. Like, hey, hey, what cell they got you in? Because there's a lot of people who do that. Hey, soon as you come through the door, I will you, I, what cell are you going to? What that is? What you, so when they come through the door, it's two white boys. You know what I'm saying? And I ain't even, listen. It depends on your mindset, and it depends on what they got going on. 
Nobody don't take no offense to this. I'm just telling you, Pentish rules and fit. Sometimes if, if, they, if they cool, you want the white boy in the cell with you. Because they gonna be chilling. Now you get you a, a, a hard-headed black, you, you gonna have a, listen to me. <laughs> now they'll lay back and chill, especially if they ain't no junk. So when they come through, you know what I'm saying, I'm examining, I'm trying. First thing I know is that he really ain't got nothing but a bed wrong. So he ain't really got no commentary. He ain't really got nothing going. I ain't even seen him. I ain't seen both of them. One of them I know, the other one I ain't seen. So he get to walking in, in, in the dirt. I said, man, that's crazy. Man, that's crazy. He, he tap on the door. Pow, pow, pow. I walk my little boy like tail up. I said, what's up? What's up? He like, oh, oh, you know who in this head? I was like, I'm in this head. What's your name, homie? He's like, man, I'm up. I said, oh, yeah, 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 I'm Joe T. He was like, oh, all right. He was like, man, oh, I guess I'm just going. I said, yeah. He said, man, you good? I said, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm good. So when he popped it off, pow. I said, I'm, I'm going to come back in a minute. I'm going to let you get situated. I ain't, I ain't got that much stuff anyway. I ain't got that much stuff anyway. Anyway, he said, I said, oh, that was almost still bustle. I'm going to bustle and go around the corner real quick. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to walk real quick. So I walk real quick. One of the guys pull up on me. He's like, oh, I see you got you one, don't you? I got you one. See, 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 you one of them, bro. You you one of them in the penitentiary. You you automatically assume somebody finna take advantage of somebody or this is a come up because a white boy moved in the cell with me. If that's what a lot of people think, oh, he got, oh, he got it one. They either, either he can call his people or get money all the time. He he gonna he gonna take a charge if they come in the cell. He gonna lay back and you know what I'm saying. He that what he think. Oh, you got you one, bro. You look, oh, he look like he's straight too. Man, what's wrong, bro? I'm not that type of dude in a penitentiary, bro. I'm not looking for somebody. I'm just, now now if they're a good cell and cool, I appreciate that. I appreciate that because they easy to talk to. Black people in penitentiary just like on the street. I ain't even gonna look like y'all normally shoot straight with you. You 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 got to act like you're tough about everything. Like you don't know when to, how to play your role, how to lay back, be cool every day, all day. You got to be macho. Right, I had a cell one time. Listen, I had a cell one time. He he fresh in a penitentiary. You probably watching this. What's up, my guy? He come in two, three days, roll back. He ain't washed his clothes, feet funky, you know what I'm saying? And I tell him, I was like, bro, I was like, bro, you probably need to wash your clothes. He jumped straight up. Man, who, who you talking to? Who you talking? Bro, you need to wash your clothes, bro. You don't smell that when you come in the cell? Man, I'm just saying, bro, ain't nobody need to tell me I need to be washing my clothes. I understand this, boy. Bro, I'm trying to look out for you. You try to get on some macho. We live in here together. You think I want to come here? I got some bleach over there right now. You know, you need to go on and wash your clothes. That's what you need to do. <laughs> but that, that's how it go. Had it been one of the Hey, I said, man, I walked in and said, you know what I'm saying? It, it, it's stinking here a little bit. Oh, what, what you think it is? That probably, your clothes? Oh, I'll wash them right now. Oh, I got the wash bucket for you right here. Oh, I can use, oh yeah, go ahead. Get you some of that bleach. Oh, no problem. Boom, boom. It, it's over with. It's over with. So I walk, <laughs> I walk around go back to the cell, right? I fade in the cell. I was like, oh, I said, you were coming out of the hole. I was like, man, I ain't never seen you before. He was like, oh, yeah, man, I was on top of the hill, man. I ain't even really like it up there. I was getting crazy up there, man. I wanted to come down here, man, and this, this, and that. He was like, man, oh. He was like, who, who got some brown down here? I said, oh, I said, I, what you trying to get? He like, man, I'm just trying to give me something to smoke, you know what I'm saying, for the next couple of days, so I give me a, a cap or something. I said, I'll get you a cap, you know what I'm saying? I'll get you a cap for 15, you might say. He said, oh, for real, Zim? I said, yeah, I'll get you a cap. He said, yeah, let me get a cap. He was like, oh, man, I'll get you, I'll get you, you know what I'm saying, later on, you know what I'm saying? I just got to get on the phone, call my people, you know what I'm saying? They got $50 for me. I'm going to go buy some commissary right here. Got what I said? <laughs> Look at Sally. Sally come straight in here looking for Brown, and Sally said he finna buy a sack. Man, did the how we good? What's that your name? Was? Tommy? Oh, what's up, Tommy? I hit him with the cool. You know what I'm saying? I ain't even hit him with the regular handshot. I hit him with the look cool. I show, gotta show Tommy how to hit up and up. I see you said you need his move. He was like, yeah, so, <laughs> I'm finna bust the move. I'm finna bust the move. I said, man, I'm finna go up here and grab this brown real quick. He ain't even knowing I got it in my pocket. I'm finna go up here and grab this brown real quick. Then when I come back, you know what I'm saying? I'm gonna go holler. I'm gonna holler at bro too. I'm gonna let you, you, you wanna call you people right now? Yeah, yeah, let me call. Yeah, yeah, if you can give, if you can give me a phone, man. That's yeah. I said, oh, well, hold on one second, then, Tommy. I fade out the cell, pow. And just in case he watching, you know what I'm saying? I go to two, three cells. He not knowing I got the phone and the tobacco on me the whole time. You know what I'm saying? Penitentiary moves, is in, penitentiary moves is in effect right now. I got to finesse him because I don't know if he the police. <laughs> I got to go to two, three different cells just in case he looking out the window. I got pow. Go in real quick, talk real quick. What y'all got going on, bro? You know what I'm saying? You ain't doing nothing. Because if he if he decided to tell the police, he could tell them folks the sales I wouldn't do. I said, that ain't got nothing to do with me. Right now, the penitentiary rules is in effect. So if you ain't never been to the penitentiary, I advise you to never go. 
to the penitentiary because you never know. Somebody probably done faded in your cell just to throw somebody out. And when they come out, they done went back down there. Oh, here you go, brother. Brother said, I can, brother, brother said we got 10 minutes. And before you know it, dude said, man, uh, he went up to such and such cell. <laughs> it's all with penitentiary games. So I fade up. Hey, bro, what y'all got going on? You know what I'm saying? I'm proud to put something together. Send bro, bro something back there to the hole. Y'all gonna send something, bro? Y'all gonna send bro something back there? Man, you need to go get that for Larry, bro. He crashed out on his own. Damn, y'all don't want to send bro nothing either. Man, that person to be in there ain't got nothing to do with GD, bro. Bro, bro shouldn't even been doing all that up at the job. Oh, there was a GD on there. I did. I'm fade back down to the cell. Oh, here you go. Uh, bro said we ain't. Bro said he got, uh, got, got about 10 minutes. Oh, here you go. The camera right here, too. Oh, here you go. Here you go. He's like, oh, that was up. He was like, oh, the phone like, oh, let me see real quick. Here you go. I'm gonna get the dough for you real quick. <laughs> oh, I right, appreciate it, appreciate it, Seth. I'm just trying to be nosy. I'm just trying to be nosy. Hey, hey, hey. Yeah, I just got out of the hole. Yeah, they got me down here on the bottom of the hill now where I was trying to get the whole time. Yeah, I'm just wondering if you could put me a 50 on green dot real quick. Oh, you already got it? Hold on, let me. Hey, Sally, what's up, Sally? <laughs> what's up? Hey, you got something I can write with? Yeah, 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 yeah. Here you go. Appreciate it. All right, go ahead. 787 35 42 16 82. Read it back, read it back. 727. Because the green dot numbers, I think they 12 or 14 digits. Get what? Brain on, brain on 10. I, 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 I got all the numbers. All right. Well, let me get on up off here. I'm gonna check them real quick, cause you know how these guys be. I said, look at Sally, Sally, hold on to it. I said, all right, all right, man, love, you. thank you. I said, all right. He said, yeah. He said, man, you don't mind real quick, though, Joe, Joe T. I'm, I'm gonna make one more call. I'm gonna call and check these numbers. You know what I'm saying? Cause you know how people play games and they like the numbers. All right, yeah, go, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, bro. He called a green dot service, right? He go, he verified the number. Well, it's on there. Here, you, here you go, Joe T. Man, I appreciate that, man. Oh. Uh, I get you uh I get you your commissary. I'm going and buy me a commissary. Zay. I said, hey, what's up? Ain't no real no, go take care of your business, Zelly. I get the phone. <laughs> fade on out of the cell, right? He fade out of the cell a couple minutes behind me, you know what I'm saying? I see him. He walk around the rock. He, he run into it's Air Nation. It's Air Nation in here selling commissary. I don't know if he knew they were Air Nation or not. All I know is he wanted to holiday, basically one of his own kind, and they were pointing him in the right direction. And if he didn't know it was Aaron Nation, you, the Aaron Nation ain't finna tell him somebody else got commissary in for sale. He gonna take him to the Aaron Nation. So he take him to the Aaron Nation, right? He going to buy some commissary. I see him come out. He got a little bit set. That was 50. I go down there to the sale, right? I go down there to the sale because he, he finna come down there. I beat him now. You know what I'm saying? I don't meet you there. I'm beat you there. Man, what's that guy going on? That sack a little short. He don't owe me no 15, though. But I just know. They supposed to give you 35 for 50. Now they ain't gonna be in here beating no my be getting over on my city now. <laughs> so I go down here, my city. Man, uh, here you go, man. He was like, man, I ain't gonna be able to give you number like five or six on it. You know what I'm saying? Cause he was like, man, I, I'm gonna be honest. He was like, man, it was some people at the top of the hill, man, and then called down here and this and that. He run this game down. I, I really ain't tripping, you know what I'm saying? Cause he just got here. He, he I could have waited to store they deal. You know what I'm saying? So I take the law like, dang, that was that crazy. You know, because I know that's how it go to the You go somewhere, they send word down there saying they want their stuff. So I ain't even tripping. I said, oh, that was up there. That's, that's cool. That's cool. That's cool. So I fade on out of the cell, right? I'm walking with one of the folks, you know what I'm saying? We prison politics, you know what I'm saying? He just put me up on some stuff, you know what I'm saying? Things going on, on top of the hill, things that happen on the yard, this is that. And then we walk one of the air nation pull up. He was like, hey, he was like, hey, Joe T, man, you might uh, holler at you for a second. I'm like, yeah, 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 what's up? You walk this walk and talk real quick. He was like, man, uh, he was like, man, what's up? You sell it, bro. I was like, what you mean? <laughs> what's up with my son? I said, my son. He said, man, uh, he said, man, uh, you know, you know, he went to, he was at the top of the hill before he moved down here. I said, yeah, he told me about that. He said, man, you know, uh, he refused, he refused to sell up there. I'm like, oh, for what? Because I'm thinking maybe they done done some research on him and found out he was a chomo. You know what I'm saying? Because they, they, you know, they, they don't be playing about that. They extort, they extort their own kind about that right there. They going to look at the paperwork. So he's like, I was like, oh, what, what he, he was like, man, you know, uh, he was, he was, uh, about to pledge a -N. I look at the folk, folk looking at me, man, folk looking at each other, folk say, ah, oh, he got he got to get up out of there, Joe. I said, I said, what? I said, 
He said, yeah, we, they was, uh, he said, bro, them, he said, bro, them was telling us, you know, that there was a guy that moved down here and he was like, uh, then when he came up there and bought the commissary and he had to pay bro them. I said, who, I said, who, 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 who he had to pay? He said, yeah, 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 man, he had, he, he had, he had to pay bro them, he owed bro them. For whatever he owed him for, you know what I'm saying? We got to get that commissary up there to the top of the hill. He was like, but we would get ready to do a heart check on him, you know what I'm saying? And then, Brodin was asking, you know, who he was in the cell with down here. And they, you know, they moved him out of the hole and they moved him in the cell with no disrespect, Joe T. No disrespect to you and your brother, you know, they moved him, you know, and what, they moved him in the cell with a black guy, huh? He's like, <laughs> no disrespect, Joe T. I'm just saying. And Brodin was asking, you know what I'm saying, have he tried to move out of the cell? And when he came and bought the, got the commissary, he didn't say nothing about trying to move out of this, isn't it? I said, well, I said, hold, hold on real quick, uh. <laughs> let, me, let, me, let me let me let me go holler at my cell real quick. So I fade on over right. <laughs> I'm gonna, I got a brother with me listen to me. He into extortion. He don't play no game. It's Al I'm gonna AA -A you. <laughs> you don't know what AA -A is, they let me know you ain't never been to the penitentiary. If you ain't never been to the penitentiary, I advise you to never go, but this aid and assistant on you defend me. I said, bro, I don't even really need that. I already know what's happening there. He said, I'm just gonna stand outside the door. I said that was so. so I fade in the cell right. Hug. I said, hey, Sally, man, you good? He was like, oh, what's going on? I said, man, oh, uh, Aaron Nation just pulled up on me. He was like, man, you, bro, they, they've been trying to recruit me since I've been here. I said, oh, I think that, that's something you should have been saying as soon as you got in here. I said, uh, they just told me you, you refused to say that you, you was in the cell with a black dude up there, right? And they, they were saying, you know what I'm saying, they were getting ready to do it. They were trying to get ready to do a hard check on you and everything. Man, I'm going to be honest with you, said. I'm gonna be honest with you, Silly. He said, "Man, uh, I, I, ain't, I didn't really want to do it. I was actually playing with them guys, man. I was just trying to get them off my back." He said, "I was on the yard walking this last time." He said, "They asked me all the time." He said, "I was on the yard walking. They were working out, man, and then they called me over. He said, I did a couple workouts with them, and then they bit. He said, "Man, I, he said, man, peer pressure, man, it's in here, man. He was like, and they like, what you gonna do? What you gonna do? We want you, bro, and this, this, and that. And you gonna, we gonna make sure you straighten it. Then they got to talking about, oh, now he trying to finesse me. And then they got to talking about, you know, you know, these black guys in here and this, this, and that. And he was like, and it kind of got to my head because, you know, the seller that I did have up there, you know, he he was kind of, you know, and, and he just felt like I, he was like, but you, you don't seem like it, bro. You seem like a good seller, man. And I was just trying to get away from coming down here, man. And I guess, I guess they don't follow me down here, bro, but it ain't nothing like that. Like, I ain't got nothing against you. You and none of your brothers, nothing like that. He was like, I wasn't, I was just, I was just playing with them guys. And he kind of chuckled when he said it. Get with bro holler. Pow, pow, pow. Hey, Joe T. I said, what's up? He come on in the cell. Pow. Bless his head. He said, man, look, bro, Joe T, I know it's your cell. No, no disrespect, bro. He said, but TP real quick for me. TP? What? He, he come in flexing like he got some authority or something. <laughs> like, like oh, he did get with my guy holler. Oh, he, oh, he, he, he straight, Joe T. He was like, man, you you on the GD protection. I look at bro, bro, look at me, me and bro, look at each other. I was like, GD protection? Ain't no such thing as GD protection. <laughs> Dude, this is a finesse move. Because now, the bro trying to figure out how he can get whatever he can get. Probably nine times ten without the guy knowing. Because he's not finna tell all the guys he got somebody in here in the GD protect. Because if they decide to do something to him in the middle of the park, GD not finna protect him. GD not finna run to his aid and assistance. We're not finna AA him. Not me anyway. Y'all do he, he, he ain't worth enough for me to crash out for him. That just ain't gonna happen. So, bro, tell him, Nick, what he said. Man, I pre man, man, man. Man, I appreciate y'all, man. Now, now, you don't appreciate me. You appreciate him. So, so he say what he finna say. We fade out of the cell. Bro, go tell the A.N. that he, that dude straight. Couple of days go back. My silly good. He cool. He cool. So we sitting in the park. Somebody done bumped down on my cell. I don't know what it was for. I don't know what was going on. All I know is I'm, st I'm standing by my door. All I know is I hear him say, man, I'm under GD protection, man. He can't be doing you. Man, he can't be doing that stuff to me. He get up and walk over to one of the guys in, in the middle of the park. The guys is out here. My guy say, man, hey, man, I'm under GD protection, man. And they, they can't be doing that stuff to me, man. Y'all say, get what I said. I fade in the cell. I'm not even, I'm not even, I didn't hear nothing. I didn't see nothing. It ain't, ain't got nothing to do with me. I don't know who told him that. I didn't witness. I don't know nothing. Who, who shot me? What? <laughs> That's all. Dude, uh, so I go in the cell. I'm chilling. Get what, bro? Come over. 
Hey, Joe T, let me holler at you real quick, man. Come on in and say, man, you see what dude just did? Man, I did, bro, bro. He tripping. What you finna do? Man, I'm finna go tell the Air Nation what he said. I said, baby, you look on dude, she said, dude. Because they're going to be over here hollering me in a minute asking who done told this man he on the GD protect. I said, I ain't never seen nothing like that in a penitentiary. How you going to bust out in the middle of the park that he on the GD protection? And then, and then got the nerve to feel like somebody done bumped down on him on the park. Like, like, we, like we top flight security here like we supposed to. Hold on now. Then he on the GD protection leave him. Like, what he got going on? He said, I don't know if it ain't. I got some form though. I <laughs> said, he fade, he fade out of the cell. I don't know what he wanted to do. Next thing you know, the air next you come down to my cell. Pop, pop, pop. Hey, hey, Joe T. We talk to you for a second. Yeah, yeah, come on up in here. Come on up in here. Come on. <laughs> so they fade in the cell. Pop. Man, bless this cell, man. I bless this cell, Joe T. Man, what's that smell you got here? You got some oil? You got some of that Muslim oil for sale? They call it Muslim oil because they think the Muslim oil one got the oil here. This is cologne. This is not Muslim oil. Then, then the third one come in. How bless, bless this cell. So when they all come over here, of course the guys come over. Pop, pop, pop. Hey, Joe T, what's up? You straight, bro? Yeah, 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 I'm good, bro. I'm good, bro. We don't be it. We don't breathe it. All right, bro, I'm going to be right here. They, they, they let, let her know what's going on. He's like, man, uh, Joe T, man, your bro just came down here, hollered us, man, and told us, you know, that, uh, the brother he got in the cell with told him that uh he was playing. He was playing with the brothers up there on top of the hill. After he had told him he was he was down for it and tell him he was gonna get a heart check set. Said he told he said, Man, I you know, I ain't trying to get you to, you know, I know we in prison, man, and nobody wanna, you know, put another man's business out there. He was like, Man, he can't be playing. He can't be playing with us like that, Joe T man, you know. And I, I know it's silly been here a couple of days. I said, Hey, what y'all wanna do? Y'all finna do a heart check on it? I said, I tell, I said, I tell you what, I said, I call him over here. I said, I'm going to call him over here. I'm going to step out of the cell, you know what I'm saying? And uh, y'all can come back over to the cell while he in here, you know what I'm saying? And I'll let the guys know, you know, I, I know this myself, and they don't want nothing going down in the cell, but you know what I'm saying? I'm going to give y'all my blessing, you know, just don't, you know, anything get, you know, y'all test something up in my cell. And he was like, oh, no, bro, we, 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 we ain't going to do nothing like that, you know, we appreciate it, but we're going we're gonna to go and we're gonna, we'll bump down on him and then, you know, we'll call him up to the cell and then we'll go from there. He was like, well, we ain't, we ain't. he was like, but I appreciate it. I was like, yeah, but yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, yeah, he did. He, he said something about, he, he was like, you know, y'all was uh trying to recruit him, trying to recruit him and, you know what I'm saying? He didn't refuse to sell to get out of cell with, you know, I know, I know y'all, he ain't refused to sell to get out of cell with black dude. He got out, he refused to sell because somebody told him he was going to go to the hole and then move him to another unit. But he not knowing we, we in the penitentiary. Ain't no hiding, ain't no getting away in the penitentiary. It don't matter where you go. He'd be like, you, you got there, right? He was like, yeah, so yeah, yeah, yeah. He was like, well, I appreciate it, Joe T, man. He was like, man, you know, I know he probably good dude. He was like, but I don't know if you'll have a sell about the end of the night, you know, brother them. Bro, them ain't uh, too fond of what they what they heard. I said, hey, hey, you know, yeah, you know, penitentiary rules and back. Go on, do what you got to do, right? Because he run around here talking about he on the GD protection. We, we ain't protecting him. I was up. I, they fade out of the cell, bro. Come on, he said, man, what, bro? What going on? I said, I guess I'm feeling being saved by myself again. I'm cool with that. He was like, oh, they feel I said, I said, so I walk off. I tell myself, hey, let me holler at you real quick. He, he come in and say, I said, man, what you got going on? I said, man, why? What you can't be doing that, man. My bad, my bad sale, man. I, I didn't know how it worked. All I know is your brother told me I was under GD protection real quick. Brother knock on the door. Pop, pop. Joe T, I need to holler. I said, hold on real quick. Let me holler him real quick. He said, he said, all right. I said, be right back. I fade out the sale. Me and bro walk out. The air nation go over. Pop, 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 pop. I see him open the door. Boom. Soon as he open the door, they, hoo, hoo. they come in. <laughs> bro said, bro said, man, yeah, he tripping, bro. I don't know what he think got going. What he got going on? So he said, man, am I straight, bro? <laughs> Don't be asking me if I'm straight. <laughs> he asked me if he's straight because he wanted if brother them done asked who who done told him he was under GD protection because they want to know who he been paying and who been getting the commentary because it ain't been Larry. So I said, I said, man, yeah, you good, bro, you good because they all you ain't gonna tell them I was in jail with you when you told that we going down, we both going, but as of right now, we we I don't know where you heard that from. I don't know where you heard that. What are you talking about? So they fade out of the cell. They take him up to next thing you know, you heard. The man, listen, the air, and when they shine, they shine. Oh, they come out, they throw him out the cell. Now get on up out of here. <laughs> get on, get on up out of here. They throw him out. He, man, man, what? They come out. Get on up out of here. Get on up out of here now. So I'm looking down there. He said, man, man, don't you holler. You want to need any protection? You, you is up out of here. <laughs> get on up out of here. <laughs> you ain't got nothing but a band roll. And as soon as they come to pack your stuff, I'm already having it rolled up for you. And if you ain't already got the book, link is in the bio. Link is in the description.
Go get the book. And I appreciate everybody who don't want to get the membership. Y'all be blessed. Y'all hold it down. <laughs> He's not on the GD, <laughs> GD protection. Gone wrong. 